What does it mean when you dream violet? Violet is a royal color. It is also the color of the Christian Lord, Jesus Christ. To dream of this color most often means that you are trying to get more in tune with your spiritual side. Violet stands for high spirituality and religious aspirations. Are you on a path to the ministry or mission work? Do you feel a higher calling, one that requires you to care for your fellow man? Dreaming of this color can mean that you do. Violet can also stand for purification, affection, gentleness, charm, and peacefulness. You may be working to gain these attributes, or trying harder to understand their true natures. You are on a spiritual journey to nourish your soul, and the presence of this color in your dreams tells you so. You have a deep sense of intuitive understanding of others and a feeling of intimacy when caring for their spiritual or even emotional needs. You are sensitive to others, and always seem to be able to tell when someone is in need of an extra boost. To dream of violet may also mean that you have great aspirations. You have lofty goals, and feel deeply that you will achieve them because of your nourishment of your spiritual self. You have always found that you seem to have great understanding of visible and invisible realms, you are just more in tune with that part of yourself and that part of the world around you. All in all, to dream of the color violet means that you are a spiritual person. You strive to achieve deep meaning and are always aware of the souls around you. Why are dreams hard to remember? Researchers estimate that 5 minutes after a dream, people have forgotten 50% of its content, increasing to 90% another 5 minutes later. Most dreams are entirely forgotten by the time someone wakes up. It is not known precisely why dreams are so hard to remember. However, there are several steps that people can take to improve their dream recall. These include Waking up naturally and not with an alarm Focusing on the dream as much as possible upon waking Writing down as much about the dream as possible upon waking Making recording dreams a routine why do we dream? There are several hypotheses and concepts as to why we dream. Are dreams merely part of the sleep cycle or do they serve some other purpose? Possible explanations for why we dream include To represent unconscious desires and wishes To interpret random signals from the brain and body during sleep to consolidate and process information gathered during the day. To work as a form of psychotherapy. From converging evidence and new research methodologies, researchers have speculated that dreaming is offline memory reprocessing, consolidates learning and memory tasks, is a subsystem of the waking default network, which is active during mind wandering and daydreaming. Dreaming could be seen as cognitive simulation of real life experiences. Participates in the development of cognitive capabilities. Is psychoanalytic, dreams are highly meaningful reflections of unconscious mental functioning. Is a unique state of consciousness that incorporates three temporal dimensions, experience of the present, processing of the past, and preparation for the future. Provides a psychological space where overwhelming, contradictory, or highly complex notions can be brought together by the dreaming ego that would be unsettling while awake. This process serves the need for psychological balance and equilibrium. As with many things concerning the brain and unconscious thought, there is so much that remains unknown about dreaming. Dreams are difficult to study in a laboratory. As technology and new research techniques are developed, 
the understanding of dreams will continue to grow. Dream interpretation is the process of assigning meaning to dreams. In many ancient societies, such as those of Egypt and Greece, dreaming was considered a supernatural communication or a means of divine intervention, whose message could be interpreted by people with these associated spiritual powers. In modern times, various schools of psychology and neurobiology have offered theories about the meaning and purpose of dreams. Most people currently appear to interpret dream content according to the Freudian theory of dreams in countries, as found by a study conducted in the United States, India, and South Korea. People appear to believe dreams are particularly meaningful, they assign more meaning to dreams than to similar waking thoughts. For example, people report they would be more likely to cancel a trip they had planned that involved a plane flight if they dreamt of their plane crashing the night before than if they thought of their plane crashing the night before or the Department of Homeland Security issued a federal warning. However, people do not attribute equal importance to all dreams. People appear to use motivated reasoning when interpreting their dreams. They are more likely to view dreams confirming their waking beliefs and desires to be more meaningful than dreams that contradict their waking beliefs and desires. Thank you.